you barking at, Inca? Probably announcing that today is the 15th. So lambing, the date that I put the ram in means that today is the day we're supposed to start lambing. But that doesn't necessarily work because the ram might not have covered a yo until the 16th or 17th. So at the moment we're in time. So if any of you ladies decide you want a lamb, hopefully that means you're on time and still not early. Because some of these yo's weren't with a ram for another two weeks. I spread out the lambing so that uh, it wouldn't be all at once. It'll be a trickle effect of lambing. So if I remember correctly, there was one yo that was covered within, uh, I think, two or three days of lambing. So she would be due sometime over this weekend. But we are now officially at January 15th lambing date. And some yo's, she's not very full, her udder's not very full. But there, are, so she'll be a later, you can see underneath, I don't know if you can see underneath, um, her udder is not very full. But there are others who have very full udders, which means they're very close to lambing, and their vulva is relaxing, which means they're close to lambing. The muscles are all letting go, as it were to make it easy for the lamb to pass through, as well as their vulvas are going sort of pinky. Another, there's a yo with a very full udder right there. And there's another one with a very full udder. So those two ladies might be lambing sometime soon. One being Bathsheba, uh, sorry, Bizu. So um, hopefully, She's crossed her legs long enough. She can release her lamb now. So, all having their second breakfast of hay. They've had their meal breakfast. Okay, ladies, you can start lambing now in the next few days.